return performance tonight. We'll see how he's going to do. Um, all right, but actually, we got to get into the match coming up right here, and I'm actually yeah, really yo, excited yo, play, for it play, because... Play. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Coltman versus Black Sheep. Now, Black Sheep is a player from the, uh, I think we button checking or... No, no. we're going straight into it. Yeah. All right, yeah. Uh, but Black Sheep, a player from... Uh, we used to see him a lot in the before online days. I uh, haven't seen him quite so much now that, you know, things have moved to, uh, you know, the Xeno Wi-Fi setting. But uh, he has had some really good results over the course of his career. And he's up against Coltman, who has had some really fantastic results uh since you know things have gone online so let's see how these two you know sort of different era players will actually match off against each other yeah th definitely different era because you didn't hear much about coleman like even in like smash 4 or offline as you said before and black sheep we only heard about him online so it, it just seems like a clash of styles on like what each one's gonna do yeah, and there's also the the issue of oh, okay, that's oh, cool. yeah. uh, of character matchup here. What are your thoughts on the Snake Mega Man matchup? Uh, it feels like well, right now we're seeing how Black Sheep is kind of struggling a little bit. One of the things yeah. is that the kill power on Snake just he finds you know a few hits, does all this damage, and then just one strong move and Mega Man explodes. Yeah, that definitely seems like the case. Because, but I feel like. Mega Man should do great in the neutral aspect of it, with pellets being able to blow up grenade at, on shield. It's just, how does Mega Man get the kill? And that's what Mega Man mainly struggles with in general, is like they have a good, great neutral, but they struggle getting kills at certain aspects of the game. And yeah. just run back <laughs> F-Smash. That was honestly such a fantastic yeah. little bait pressure. Managing to get that huge stock now, uh, oh, just barely surviving that up tilt. And for the most part, Black Sheep, it seems like he's doing fine at the ledge, you know, when a character is against Snake at the ledge. It's some for some characters, that's it's hell on earth, but for the most part, Black Sheep's getting out of there. But uh, the bigger problem is, well, now that we have you know, now that he no longer has to worry about taking a stock. He's playing the neutral that he feels more comfortable with, and he's actually able to start to, you know, make a difference in this deficit, 78% and growing. We haven't yeah, seen all oh, return Snake. to neutral in quite a while. Yeah, Snake just eating that back air right there. Oh, great air dodge right there. Oh, Whoa! and just both players blowing up. <laughs> now we're down to a one-stop game, Salty. Yeah, no, I'm... <laughs> And that's actually really important, you know, if that stock, if, if that had stock had gone one way, for either player, it would have been huge. Uh, these two characters in particular, getting a stock lead is massive, oh my. You rarely see him go for that forward air off stage, but that would have just been the game if it hit. Yeah, he wanted his soul. Okay, great, just fastball fair right there, just getting out of that situation. And we're just seeing Black Sheep just going all over him. A oh, nice read right there. And Black Sheep is just in a bunch oh. of trouble. Is that going to be it? No, not just oh. yet, but we see. <laughs> yeah, he's uh, dead. Mm -mm. Did he... He didn't have his air dodge left? Was that what happened? No, I think he still had his air dodge. But he probably thought he had his jump. Ah... Uh. Yeah, he kind of... Well, yeah, let's get a look yeah, at this replay. Yeah, you see how he used his jump right there. He lives. Oh, no, he did use his air dodge to avoid the blast zone. And then he... Yeah, he kind of was forced to drift back because of that yeah. down smash. And then wasn't able to drift in further. There was... That's kind of a... At yeah. that point, his resources had been exhausted and... Yeah, that, you know, that's a how, tricky situation. That's a part... That's one where you have to, like, fast fall to mix up your timing. And... Fastball perfectly where you grab the ledge. And that's really hard to do on Wi-Fi in general. And also, it's he he would have to be extremely strict with it because he needed that drift. He needed yeah. that horizontal drift. And Mega Man is, a, you know, he falls pretty fast. So once you press yeah. down, you're kind of going to just sink like a rock. Yeah, so that made Rocket his... Man for a reason. <laughs> <Man>. <laughs> the dude is literally made of metal. Um yeah. But, okay, so in that game, we, we were saying how the ledge trapping maybe wasn't as big, but the 
by the end, the edge guarding was off stage yeah. gameplay ended up being really important, especially at the end there. So as we're moving into this game too, the probably the biggest adjustments that need to be made are just, you know, when like I mean just getting hit off stage, you can't you don't want to die for it. You know, taking damage is whatever, but And this exactly. is probably the most elite smash thing I've seen in a long time. Just picking PS2, but making it Battlefield version. <laughs> Ooh. Wow. Okay, using... Oh, that's... Oh, he's going to be okay. Both yeah, players are going to be making it back fine. And actually, Black Sheep with a little bit of stage control, going way out there trying to get a deep edge guard. Actually still able to continue the pressure, even though he himself winds up on the ledge. And now we have only about 30% separating these two, but now we have Black Sheep off stage. Can he make it back? He does. Actually able to reverse the situation. Yeah, Black has been doing a lot of that. Yeah, it just seems when one person gets momentum, they just carry on a lot of percent with it. And there we actually see the, the first successful edge guard with an up tilt just reading the jump. Yeah, and actually, Black Sheep led into that really nicely because he popped the, uh, the little crash bomber onto him, which meant that uh, he had to shield when normally he'd be vulnerable trying to... Uh, also, he took... A, he's at 100. He's dead. Oh, my. Hold on. That, that stock went so quick. I, I I barely had time to finish the thought. It, just snake's it, damage output. What? Yes, you know, Snake knows when to go off, man. So Black Sheep is just struggling to keep up right now. And we just seen the adaptation from Col Coltman just on one of our bets. Yeah. Although that was how Black Sheep managed to take the first stock in last game as well. So Yeah, but this time he is down a complete stock. And the last time he had a bit of assistance from Coleman, just with both of them exploding each other. This time he might, he doesn't have the luxury of that because if they were to trade stocks, he would lose. Yeah, and okay, that's what we were talking about before. That down smash just covering once Mega Man is forced to drop with no other options. Oh, able to eat through all of that back air, goes in for a deep edge guard. Actually manages Black Sheep. With a little yeah, bit of stage yeah. control here, but yeah, adaptations coming into play. Definitely oh, not able to. You do saw that trap? I just saw doing that. the up smash, then going off stage, just not giving Black Sheep a lot of options right there. Alright, some yeah, okay. solid positioning from Black Sheep. He needs to take this stock immediately, and even if he does, it's still gonna be really rough for him. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah. And Black Sheep just kept getting punished for going high. He just opted not to grab Ledge and just jump over it, try to jump over Coleman, and Coleman just punished him every single time. So, well, he was Coleman. getting away. That's like when you talk about the adaptation earlier on in the set. That was how he was getting off the ledge. We were saying, oh, you know, for the most part, Black Sheep, he's getting off the ledge. Not really, issue, not really an issue in, in that game, too. The high recoveries were just punished every single time by the end. Uh, so that's going to be a 2-0 victory for Coltman. Coltman going to be moving on on the winner's side of things. Uh, but, you know, we might see more from Black Sheep. He's a solid player, and let's see how his loser's run is going to go. All right. Yeah. Do we have our uh, our next contestants already in the wings? Do we know who it's going to be? No. <laughs> 